Cybersecurity continues to be one of the most important topics in programming today. If you work with relational databases, preventing SQL injection attacks represents the bare minimum when securing your program. If you think you can come up with a fancy way to escape user inputs and prevent SQL injection, stop. There will always be an edge case that you can't imagine, let alone test for. The standard way to correctly secure your application is to sanitize user inputs using parameterized queries. The placeholder character will vary slightly depending on which database you're working with. But the concept of the pattern is to create the query in two components. The main request and the user input pass separately as a parameter. By using this pattern, you prevent user input being treated as code by your application or the database. But if you're like most Python programmers and the only user you have is yourself, maybe just consider not attacking your own program? That way you don't have to worry as much about security.